Madagascar's president, Andre Rajoelina, has hit back at critics of an untested herbal tonic that he is promoting as a treatment for coronavirus, despite it not having gone through clinical trials. Last week, the World Health Organization issued a warning against people using untested remedies for coronavirus. Nevertheless, the tonic known as COVID Organics has been sent to several African countries. Mr. Rajoelina says that criticism of the drink shows what he called Western nations' condescending attitude to traditional African medicine. Madagascar is putting its self-proclaimed COVID-19 cure on sale despite warnings from the World Health Organization that the plant-based remedy is not proven. A delegation from Tanzania has already collected their consignment, with Foreign Minister Palama Gamba Kabudi saying Madagascar had made Africans proud. And let me tell the people of Madagascar, you have made us Africans proud. You have made Africa proud because now Madagascar is providing is contributing a solution to a global problem. We've been always used that it is Europe and Western Europe and other countries which do contribute to global problems. The WHO Africa head has said she's concerned people who have drunk the products might feel they are immune to COVID-19 and engage in risky behavior. The WHO has said COVID-19 organics need to be tested for its efficacy and any side effects. But as far as the country is concerned, it's providing a solution. So there are some critics, there are some suspicion, but the most important thing is that we are offering a solution to save lives and to help other people. And I think that is very important. And then everyone has a choice. To accept it or not. Madagascar has been giving away thousands of bottles of COVID-19 organics, which was developed by the state-run Malagasy Institute of Applied Research. Tanzania, Equatorial Guinea, Central African Republic, the Republic of Congo, the Democratic Republic of Congo, Liberia and Guinea-Bissau have already received thousands of doses free of charge. The African Union says it's trying to get Madagascar's technical data on the remedy and will pass that to the Africa Centers for Disease Control and Prevention for evaluation.